Hi, Demi Jack here. Now, today is a follow-up video to a video I made last year. Now, this video I made last year is called was called Along the Lines or something like EA Skates Again or something. Now, as you may have known, EA has said they're working on the next skate installment. Well, news about that has come out today. As promised, EA has shared a little something related to its highly anticipated skate revival after announcing there'd be no news on the latest installment of its long dormant skateboarding series during this Thursday EA Play Live. Skate fans probably shouldn't get too excited though, beyond confirmation that the game is still in the works, there's little to see here. Announced last June, EA Skate's revival, a fourth game in the series, and the first installment since 2010, Skate 3 is being worked on by recently formed studio Full Circle, which counts original Skate's creator Dan Darren Chung and Cuz Perry among its numbers. Given that Full Circle only formally came into existence at the end at the start of this year, work on new Skate game is unsurprisingly still in the early stages, and Chung said as much as EA's new teaser video, the truth is it's still early. He explained, we're working on it. It's no surprise that the gameplay is nowhere to be found in the video. But we do get a selection of grops and gas from various devs, skateboarding stars, and YouTubers who are told have seen some of the in-game footage. For everyone else though, EA fills in the blanks with glimpses of behind the scenes motion cap seasons, sessions and odd wireframe. There is then little for skate fans to probably get excited about, beyond reassurance that part 4 is still in development, and the long long wait continues for more substantial views. It, alongside Skate's EA Play Live No Show, EA confirmed there will be no appearances from Dragon Age and Mass Effect or any of its future Star Wars styles during the 40 minute livestream this Thursday 22nd of July at 6pm. It's probably safe to expect on Apex Legends or Battlefield 2042 though, and Eurogamer will be reporting live through the event. Well, first I want to say this, you're probably thinking what I'm thinking, but EA Play's gonna suck this year. If we're not getting Skate, and we're not getting Dragon Age, and we're not getting Mass Effect, or any future Star Wars titles, I don't give a crap about EA Play. Those are the only games I'm interested in at the moment, and if I don't can't see what's going on, then I don't want to see EA Play. Sorry, but EA Play's cancelled for me. Cancelled. Cancelled. Not watching EA Play. However, I do think they should have shown at least some footage of Skate. Now, as we know, as it says... Where does it say? Here we go. That it's no surprise that gameplay is nowhere to be found in the video, but we do get a section of grops and gaps from various devs, skateboarding stars, and YouTubers who we have been told have seen in-game footage. So why do YouTubers, skateboarding stars, and of course, devs, get to see footage, but us, the average show? Yes, I am a YouTuber, but I did not see the footage. I'm too small for EA to give a fuck, so please subscribe to the channel. However... I do think that we ask the average Joes, mind you, I may be a YouTuber, but I am very, very small, so I'm pretty sure I count as an average Joe. We should at least see some sort of footage. Like, come on, show some footage. Like, I want to see footage. This game has at least been in development from what we know at least June last year, probably longer, and they're not showing footage? That's... I don't like that. So I think they need to show footage. I think they really owe us, the average Joes, to show footage. That's what I think. And I think EA Play this year is going to suck. I'm just going to say, if we're not getting Skate, Dragon Age, Mass Effect, or any Star Wars games, then it's going to suck. I'm just saying that. It's going to suck. It's going to suck so bad that it's going to suck. So, what do you think the other average Joes think about this topic? Do you think they should have shown skate footage to us average shows? Do you think they should have shown at least some sort of footage? I think they should have showed footage. Do you think they should have shown footage? It is cool that they did show motion caps and stuff like that. But I want to see footage, bro. I want to see footage. Anyway, as always, if you did like the video, please make sure to give it a like. As that lets me know what topics you like and what topics you dislike as well as let me know what you want to see next, as well as comment down below in the comment section down below, and 
subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet for I cover gaming news, pop culture on the side, content creators, as well as leaks and rumors. And I'll see you all probably tomorrow because I may actually get a video done tomorrow, if not Thursday, but I may actually be able to get a video done on Wednesday tomorrow for the first time in like forever. So I'll see you all next time. I am Demi Jack.